we all love Miss Muhammad. If the world had about 35 more Mrs. Muhammad, the whole world would be better. My job is to assist around the school. This year is my first year here in the copy room. Anything that the teachers request, it has to be created, I create it. I have been behavior coach for years and I worked in life skills. So yes, I have experience uh, in working in classroom. You just have to have patience with kids and know, you know, learn and be willing to learn learn them and work with them. She has a self-initiative, she gives of herself, it's endless her giving and she works well with all the students and all the staff members. She's priceless. Some of the other things that I do around here is to help out in the cafeteria. We gather the food together for the students, pass them out. And she thinks about the outcome for the students as well as the staff. But when there's an event here at ABS West, we come together, we think about, we think, put our brains together, we think about how we're gonna decorate, and it's like we're both thinking of the same things and she'll say something and I'll say something like, wow, I can't believe this, you said the same thing. I'm a twin. They had us in a little baby drawer. And so it's like, they don't have no names. And my grandmother made quilts. So my little cousin goes, this one like the quilts. That one have patience for the feeding. So they, my mom said, her and her sister looked at each other like, okay, which one gonna be Patches and which one gonna be Patience? <laughs> so that's how we got our name. That's how I got the name Patches. I had a special needs uh, cousin. And I told my grandmother, I said, I'm gonna start reading to him. She said, you could try. I don't know if he gonna get it. You know, Jack and Jill went up the hill and I was reading that to him, right? And he said it and my grandmother said he wasn't gonna be able to say it, he said it. And she said, you know, she called me mama. She said, you know what, mama, you have a talent. You are gonna be a teacher because you done taught this boy how to read and write. So I, from that time, at the age of 13, 14, I would run a school out of my bedroom. <laughs> I had a library set up and the neighborhood kids would actually come and check out books and read with me and I would be helping them with their homework. My, my siblings, they hated me because <laughs> if they didn't have homework, I made them some and now my grandkids can't stand me. <laughs> I like the way the Department of Harris County Department of Education celebrate us when we're coming back to school. They go all out of the way. We get sized, you know, so I like that. I just love coming to, to, to my job. I like helping. I like, you know, being a part of HCDE. I, I just love being a part of the company. I love doing what God put me here to do.